we got to celebrate National Pasta Day, and we're going inside a local business that's gained national acclaim for its Italian staples. We're talking about Rosina Food Products in Chictawaka. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Twila Nugent is actually inside the, pa the pasta plant taking us for a tour. Hi, Twila, good morning. There is so much going on here, and it's actually a little loud because they are processing ravioli right now inside the plant here. We've got Bob Whipple with us this morning, the Senior Vice President of Human Resources. Tell us a little bit about the job opportunities you have here. Well, we're actually, we've been growing very rapidly, so we really have positions available for both pasta makers and cheese uh, meatball makers. Uh, we also are looking for people in the, some of the support positions as well, quality, warehouse, maintenance, and that sort of thing. People interested in applying can apply directly at our location at 75 Industrial Parkway in Chictawaga, or they can go to our website, and uh, there's a link there to opportunities that are available at Rosina. What is it like having a local company grow so big and being able to bring Western New Yorkers into that? Well, it's it's uh, it's it's a source of a tremendous pride for us as uh, associates here, and of course the family that owns the organization. Uh, as I mentioned earlier, uh, our Solentano Pasta is a number one brand at retail across the country. We're actually in 97 of the top 100 chains across the country, so we enjoy very, very wide distribution. And actually, our product is now sold internationally as well. So um, we're in uh, Central America, South America, the Caribbean, and that sort of thing. So it's, uh, it's a tremendous source of pride for us to see our product in such wide distribution. How much pasta do you guys produce here? Well, this plant will produce over 20 million pounds of pasta this year, so it's pretty impressive. The plant runs 24 hours a day. We produce uh, product on first and second shift, and then our third shift over the evening hours is cleanup and sanitation. And we employ people, you know, obviously through those, uh, those three shifts. So incredible. Job opportunities, and also you can celebrate National Pasta Day, where we're live here in West Seneca at the very busy and very noisy plant at Tweela Newton, 7 Eyewitness News. 20 million pounds of pasta this year alone. What do you wow. think that even looks like? Heaven. I would Ooh. love to see. <laughs> My fridge, probably. Right? Yeah, that's great. Wow. wow. Well, again, they are hiring. They employ about 500 people around Western New York. They're right in cheek to Waga, and they're making product for national grocers, yeah. which is a huge deal for us here yeah. in Western New York. Oh, absolutely. Really interesting to me to hear about the different shifts and how each is responsible for different things, because I would think the plant just keeps running, right? No. Got to stop, clean it up, keep going. There you go. Very yeah. cool. We'll post a link for you if you're interested in applying for a manufacturing job on our Hiring 716 website. And you get to wear wear one of those cool hats like I Wasn't yeah. that neat? <laughs> we're actually hearing from her. They were they're very clean. They were going through a deca uh, decontamination process oh, right. in between good. live shots to make sure that they didn't bring any germs into the uh, factory, which wow. is kind of cool. All the germs from our newsroom. You don't uh, want those in your meatballs. Right. No. <laughs>